Tonight, more than half of the students at Gettysburg College are packing up their things and preparing to move out as soon as tomorrow. Good evening, I'm Danielle Woods. I'm Janelle Stelson. The school is calling it de-densifying and says the decision comes after a coronavirus outbreak forced the entire campus to quarantine earlier this week. WGAL News 8's Jeremy Jenkins reports. The number of positive cases have spiked in such a short time. On Friday, Bob Iliano, president of Gettysburg College, made this announcement. In consultation with our board, public health experts, and others, we have found it necessary to reduce the number of students on campus for the remainder of this semester. As of September 1st, 347 students have been tested for coronavirus. Of those students, 323 tested negative, 24 were positive. Now the school wants to cut the number of students on campus from more than 2,500 to just 900. According to the college website, students from Pennsylvania, Maryland, or D.C. must leave by September 5th. Will Esposito is one of them. I'm just not ready to go. New Jersey, Delaware, and New York students get an additional day. Students from other states have until Monday, September 7th. Esposito, who's a junior, says he's thankful the college is taking action, but he finds the plans far from well executed. The fact that they sent out this email um, at 11.30, and then five hours later, they sent out an email saying that you're all going home. It uh, it was it felt a little strange. In Lancaster, Jeremy Jenkins, WGAL. News 8. Now, first year transfer and international students, along with those who are unable to return home, will remain on campus. Gettysburg College says adjustments will be made to billing and financial aid plans for everyone else over the next few weeks.